Hey beauties, so it's your Rebecca. I am back with another video. And today I decided to do a makeup video because people are always asking me to do makeup tutorials. So I wanted to start off with something simple, something easy, but something very cute. So let's get into this video and let me show you how to take this and turn it into this. But before we go on, if you guys like makeup videos and want to see more, definitely go ahead and press the like button so I can know to do more. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on my next video. Let's get straight into it. Okay guys, so the first thing that we want to go ahead and do is take our concealer, some kind of primer base to put on our eyes. And I take the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Toffee. And I just put it all over my eyes because I want the eyeshadow to stick to my eyes. And I don't want it to, you know, kind of melt away or, you know, kind of do that thing where it's just not there at the end of the day. So that's what I'll do. So I'll go ahead and prime my eye to make it stick and also make sure that it's more noticeable. So the palette that I'm using today is the Jaclyn Hill palette from Morphe. And I really love this palette, guys. Like, this palette has so many great colors. So the first color that I'm going to get into is a light color. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys here on the screen. It's more of like an orangey color and you really want to just get that at the top. Um, feel free to pack it on as much as you want. It really doesn't, it's not a bad thing to pack it on because it's going to be kind of like your shadowy color, like the ombre color. You're going to have like that ombre effect with it. So go ahead and pack it on. So then after you get that there, you want to take this next color and put that one a little bit in your crease. Just kind of put it in there. Get a good amount and just put it in there. And then once you do, you want to start like fluffing it out because you're going to start blending it away into that color. You want that kind of gradient effect. So now I'm just going to push it up a little bit and start, you know, blending it out a little bit. Oh, and remember guys, I am not a makeup artist. Just letting you know, I'm just a girl who likes to do my makeup and get it done. So yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and buff that out a little bit. I want to blend that out. And I'm going to do that to both sides. So after you're done blending that out, you are gonna take your next color, which is like a darker, more like burgundy-ish color. It's like a, it's a deeper color. You wanna start off from light and get into your darker color to have that gradient. You wanna pack it into the corner of your eyelid. I'm gonna buff it out and blend it out into that other color so it can have that gradient effect. So once I feel like I have enough on, on my eyelid and I feel like it's pronounced enough where I can really see the color, I can really see the gradient effect, the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and take that concealer again and put it on my eyelid and create kind of like a cut crease. Now if you're a beginner like me, you know, feel free to add a little bit at a time. You don't have to be like these professionals on Instagram and just wipe away put a little bit at a time because you honestly don't want to put too much and it's really good to know your eyelid um some people will put so much concealer that it covers their whole eyelid but for me i like to give myself a nice but subtle look where the makeup is there and when you see me you know that i have my makeup done but it's not too much and then once I'm done with that, I'm gonna go ahead and grab like this gold shimmery color and I pack that in the inner corners of my eyelids. And 
And then after I did that, I went ahead and grabbed a more orangey color. So it can be like more of like a gradient effect. And I put that in the middle, pack that in the middle of my eyelid and just put that in there. So then once I put on those colors, I'm gonna go ahead and take that brush that I was using earlier for the deeper color and use it in my crease to create a transition so those lines are not so harsh and all the colors can blend into one another because I wanna go ahead and blend those top lines. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the next eyelid. Once I'm done with that, of course, I'm just gonna go into my regular routine of using my eyeliner that I have from NYX. Love this stuff, guys. It lasts so freaking long, so I would recommend it. Um, and then my mascara from Maybelline. I always do this before putting on lashes. The lashes that I'm using are from Eyelure. This is their Definition Lash. Y'all, my favorite. Literally, like, they always do the job. And then I'm just gonna stop talking now and let you guys watch me finish getting ready. And I'll come back to the end. That's how your girl literally goes from this and turns it into this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any comments, please let me know down in the comment box below. Remember, this is my first eyeshadow tutorial and I am not a makeup artist. Your girl is just getting better and learning as she goes on and I'm sharing what I learned. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you guys try out this look. And I hope that it works out for you guys. If it does, definitely let me know. Tag me on Instagram. I'll go ahead and repost you guys in my Insta story. Thank you guys so much for watching my first eyeshadow tutorial. Like, I literally appreciate you guys. And if you haven't already liked this video, but you like makeup videos and want me to try out another one, definitely go ahead and press the like button. And if you haven't subscribed, girl, go ahead and subscribe so I can see you in my next one. Bye, beauties. Until next time. Hey, feeling good, like I should Winning, go, go, go